What's going on YouTube? We are back today in Madden 16 Ultimate Team. We have some uh, new players today, new final editions. I'm going to go over the all rookies uh, that were released on Monday. So let's go, let's start off with the all rookies. Um, the only good one that I saw was the David Johnson 95 overall running back. Uh, he looks really good. His 91 uh, Team of the Week version was... Uh, I've heard was really good. I've never played with them, but apparently it's really good. And uh, I would say this 95 version is probably a lot better. It's an upgraded version, so obviously it's going to be a lot better. Uh, other than that, there's not really any other uh, really good all rookie players. They had a they added a kicker this week, which yeah, who uh, I don't know why they did that, but uh, eh, not really anything. I want that David Johnson does look good, but I'm hoping they release that uh, gauntlet sometime soon so we can just get Marshawn Lynch and not have to worry about it. Uh, there is some new sets that came in. Uh, all rookie, if you add all the uh, offensive players, you get a Marshall Falk. I'm not sure what his overall is. But you would get him, and uh, on the defense, you get Brian Dawkins if you add all the rookie defenders. So, in special teamers, I think. Yeah. So, uh, two solid players. I don't know what their overall will be. I'm imagining it's going to be probably 99 overall, but I don't know. Uh, other than that, I think that's about all the sets for the rookies that came out. So, let's go over the new Final Edition players that just came out today. And uh, this Patrick Chung, I have him currently, the 89 overall version on my team. I would say this uh, 96 overall, yeah, 96 overall version would be pretty good. Because the 89 plays well for me. He's got good run stuff. So I'd imagine this one probably plays just as well. But he's probably pretty expensive. At least for right now. I'm sure he's going for like 400k or something like that. But uh, all the other players, not really anyone I want. But well, Darius Green has good speed. I know he has great speed. But uh, he's only 88 overall. It's not really what I'm looking for. What's his speed? Yeah, 94 speed. He's a good speed uh, tight end. If you need someone fast, he's good for that. But other than that, not really anything I would want. Cameron Jordan. Eh, don't really already know what I want on my end. Uh, new left guard. He has good run block, but his pass blocking is pretty bad, I think. Was it the other way around? Yeah, good run block, bad pass block. He is a left guard. What's his speed? Yeah, it's kind of slow. Kind of slow. Uh, Kerrigan. It's probably, he's more of a line guy than a linebacker. I would put him on my line, but I already know what I want to do with my line. He has decent speed. I'm sure his zone coverage is probably terrible. Probably like 70 something, maybe 60 something. Yeah, 70. That's about right. So, eh, no, don't really want Kerrigan. If you want him, I'll put him on the line and not uh, at linebacker. And then Eric Decker, which isn't really anything special. But I have a feeling by the end of the week, this card will be pretty cheap. You, you can probably get him for under 100k. Because there's really no amazing Final Edition player out there. I could see making this card very expensive once more people start to open packs. Uh, other than that, that's about it for Final Edition players. The Gauntlet is still not out for March. This is the 2nd of March. You would think they would have that out. It's the last one you need for the Marshawn Lynch. But, no, it's EA. I know the February one took... Like, almost two weeks before it came out. So it's kind of just frustrating that they're just slacking. The coin-up that was supposed to be done Monday wasn't done till late Tuesday night. So that was, that's frustrating, too. They're kind of slacking over there at EA. They still, still haven't gotten this right yet. Malcolm Jenkins is still a wide receiver. Good job. Uh, I don't think there's any new packs. When do they, these probably expire Friday. Oh, they expire. Okay, so new packs come tomorrow. 
see what they what uh what they're talking about. Uh, solos, nothing really new except the final edition solo, which you get every week. And I think that's about it. Nothing really else to go over right now. Go check out Von Miller's price, hoping it went down. This Von Miller here is under 140k. That's when I'm gonna snag him. One seventy right now. That was a four eighty. Okay. Still still a little expensive. Uh, I'm hoping that collectible was gonna come down for his team of the week, so I was looking at that yesterday too. And uh fortunately uh, it goes for like a hundred K or something like that. If it went for cheaper than like hundred and five K, I would buy that so quick. Uh, everything else in this set's pretty cheap. That's why I was looking at that. Other than this David Johnson, who's, uh, amazing, apparently. Goes for 50k right now. But, uh, I think that's gonna do it for this, uh, episode. Not really a whole lot to go over, but, uh, some new things. A little... Oh, and John, the John Randall, uh, 98 Ultimate Legend went... All the way down to 600k yesterday when I was looking at it. So that's impressive that his price has gone down that much. Yeah, 567 right now. 560. His price just keeps on dropping every day. So I won't be surprised if this John Randall starts dropping off. Uh, below uh, 400k so that's crazy just keeps dropping daily and uh, if they get a like I said they get that ultimate legend guaranteed 98 or above player a lot of people are gonna buy it or just a guaranteed ultimate legend not a collectible piece just an ultimate legend their price is gonna drop and people could be I'm gonna get on it and buy a these ultimate legends I want. But I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Uh, really nothing else to go over right now. Still just looking for, waiting for this uh, weekend to get here. So I can make some moves on this team. Hopefully Legend Bundle drops so I can make moves. Cheap moves. Cheap, but uh, very good moves. So I already have some things in place for uh, Legends. So we'll just go wait. Hope for the weekend drops a legend, but also some of those collectibles come down. I can just uh, finish those sets for under. Sorry, had the badges for like under 100k, probably even under 50k. So I'm hoping for. I can get both players for like 100k. That would be nice. But uh, we're gonna wait. We got uh, some packs to open. Maybe probably open them this weekend. Maybe do another large quick sell like we did last weekend. Open a couple of packs to a large quick sell. And uh, maybe get lucky. We'll see. And I'll probably then make the moves in that video too. That's going to be the end of this video guys. Like, subscribe, comment, share. I'm out till next time as always. Do work.